YouTube, what is up? It's your boy DRock779 coming back at you again with another video. This time, this video is important to me or whatever. The reason why I say that is because, as you're going to see in the title, um, I think I, don't, I didn't even make the title yet, but the title is probably going to be um, Did I? No, 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 it's not Did I Get Scammed. The title is going to be um, Do You Think I Took an L on this trade? Because it was a trade, no money involved, straight trade, right? Now, I've been sitting, if I have more sneakers than the average person, or like I'm not no big sneaker YouTuber or nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? I'm just the average Joe, but I do have more sneakers than the average person. So with that being said, you know if you have more sneakers than the average person, that um, you're probably going to have a couple that are just sitting there that, you know, maybe one or two, three that you haven't even worn yet. Things like that. Like, I'm still, like, I still haven't even worn my Space Jams yet. Or whatever. Like, sometimes I forget I got them. But anyways, so, um, I got a guy that I met, um, while going to some of the sneaker conventions. So he got up with a couple of other vendors or whatever, and they opened up their own uh, shop down in Soho. So what I decided to do, um, the shop has been open for a while, but I haven't been able to make it down there. So yesterday I wasn't really doing anything. Yesterday was Saturday. Today's Sunday. I was supposed to make this 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 video last night when I got in, but I fell asleep. Whatever. So they made um they came and you know got together and they made their own store and and everything right. So. I finally decided to go down there. I said, you know what? I need to go down there or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm sitting on one or two sneakers that I'm not even wearing. And I know I'm not going to resell it. So it's like, I'd rather just take it down there, do a trade for something that I know I'm going to wear. So the sneakers I decided, it was two pairs. So the sneakers I decided to take were the 7210s, dead stock, and the Kilroy 9s. Uh, Jordan Kilroy 9s. That one. Um, the Kilroy 9s I got from SneakerCon. I only paid $100 for it, uh, for them, but I didn't like how they looked on my feet. They looked too too bulky, so I really couldn't come across anything to rock with. So they, so they just been sitting there ever since SneakerCon last year and everything. So I decided to take those two. So I get down there and uh, finally find a place. I get inside. And it's um it wasn't as big as I thought it was gonna be, but you know they're just starting out, so you know it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Um, and it was Saturday, so he was kind of low on. I think they were, cause it's like three or four vendors, so I think they were all kind of low on inventory, cause it wasn't for me. It wasn't too much there for me to like pick and choose. They ooh 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 ooh. Nah, you know what I'm saying? But there was one sneaker. That stood out to me that I wanted or whatever. I haven't gone hard to try to get it, but it was a sneaker that I did want or whatever. It was actually uh, two sneakers there that I want. Um, I'll tell you about one of them. One of them was uh, the the Royal Ones. I saw them there. I was like, oh, you got the Royal Ones. So I'm like, cool. Do this trade. Boom, boom, bow. If I got to add a little bit more, cool, because I bought 200 with me. So I'm like, boom. Or whatever, but I really didn't want to spend the 200. So I pull the sneaker out, flip it to the back. I see the price on it, and the price is like 400. I was like, oh hell no. I'm like, nah, I'll wait. Like, it ain't that serious. I'll wait. You know what I'm saying? Because they drop on April, f I think April 1st, I believe. Um, uh, I think so, or whatever. Next month they drop on, um, on the 1st, or whatever. So I'm already going to be at the store picking them up. You know what I'm saying? So that's a given right there. So I wasn't worried about those because I wasn't trying to, 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 to do that or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So I'm still looking around, looking around. And then out of nowhere, a grail, in my opinion, you know what I'm saying? It's a grail for me. It's a grail for me. Now, I don't want to tell you what it is yet because I'm going to get into it right now. We're gonna we're gonna open it up. We're gonna do it right now. But I got let me go into the trading part. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm getting over a coat. Right, let me go into the trading part. <coughs> so 
um, I'm talking to the guy to make the trade, and I'm like, yo, I got these 7210s dead stock or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Now, the sneaker I wanted, he was, uh, was priced at 220 dead stock. So I'm like, cool. You know what I'm saying? But then I'm like, nah, not cool because I know he'll do the trade because he's a dead stock and I paid 350 for them. But then I'm like, I'm losing out. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, he got to throw something else in there. You know what I'm saying? So we making a deal. And then he's telling me, he's like, he's like, bro, he's like, I take them, but you know, when I resell them, I'm only gonna get about like maybe two, two twenty five for them or something like that. So you know, you know, I can't do you know, three fifty or nothing like that. I'm like, I understand. You know what I'm saying? So then he sees the other pair, the Kilroys, and the Kilroys were used or whatever, but you know, still in good condition or whatever. So he's like, all right, I do both of them, and you know what I'm saying because the sneakers you want. They go for like 300 or so at Fight Club. You could take them to Fight Club and you could get like 300 for them or whatever. And I'm like, nah, I'm not a reseller. You know what I'm saying? Like when I get shoes, they're mine. I wear them. So he's like, all right, cool. So you want to do it? And I'm like, I'm like, so now I'm thinking, I'm like, should I do it? I'm like, yes, on one hand, because I'm like, I know I'm not going to find these sneakers. I shouldn't have said I'm not going to find these sneakers because I always find the sneakers that I want for a lower price. You know what I'm saying? It's just about being patient. You know what I'm saying? But I wasn't patient yesterday. So I'm like, okay, I'm sitting on these 72 cents for a year now and haven't worn them and I'm not wearing a Kilroy. So I'm like, just do the trade. See if he can throw you in something else or whatever. So I'm like, all right, you got uh, hats. Throw me in two hats. We good. Or whatever, because the hats were like $25 each. So I'm like, throw me in two hats. He's like, I can do one hat, you know what I'm saying? Because the hats aren't mine. So I'm going to have to pay for that. So I'm like, come on, bro. Because, you know what I'm saying? You know, I'm already losing out. So I'm, I, I pull the trigger. I decide to make the deal. You know what I'm saying? Made the deal. And on one hand, the majority of me is happy because what I cop. I know I'm going to wear it. No doubt about it. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm going to wear it. But then on the other hand, I'm like, did I just like kind of lose out? You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, you uh, YouTube, I need your help. Comment down below. Let me know what you think if I lucked out on this deal or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Um, I did some research and I don't think I did. Uh, luck out. If anything, it was maybe even. You know what I'm saying? And I'll tell you why. But, you know what I'm saying? Enough of the chit chat. You guys want to see the shoes, right? So, we're going to get right into it. Let me just grab a grape real quick. Damn. What we have here is the, uh, I'm about to say Jordan, <laughs> LeBron's, LeBron 12s, LeBron James, LeBron James, alright, we have the 12s, now I don't know if you know what 12 these are based on the box by itself, you know what I'm saying, but you're about to see, and to me this is a grill. To me, I don't know what you think. Matter of fact, comment down below. You, you let me know if this is a grill or not. All right, so we're gonna get right into it. Woo! <laughs> oh boy! All right, here we go. Bam! The what the LeBron's 12. Now. I wanted this sneaker ever since the first time like I laid eyes on it or whatever or you know what yeah since the first time I laid eyes on it meaning like I saw somebody with it and like these sneakers they just pop like these are crazy these are crazy I had to make this video because I have a tendency for wearing my shoes first then making the videos after or whatever, but with this one, I had to do the video first. I'm actually rushing right now because I, I got to go to work in a little while. 
So I'm actually rushing this video. But as you can see, I haven't worn them yet. And it's so much detail. Like, I'm like, okay, we're gonna go into this shoe first and then the second one. But look at the details in this shoe. Crazy. This is crazy. Like this is like I said, this is a grail for me. This is a grail for me. Wow. Just look on the inside. Look on the inside. Wow. Damn. I don't know. Look at this one. Whew. I don't know which one is better. Oh man, even the um the lace tips are different colors. Like, see this? Is, oh man, like I'm so tongue tied right now. This is unbelievable. Look at this. Oh, just so you know, I wasn't lying. The price tag still on. It. See that? <clears throat> These are crazy. Like when when I got them, the guy even said to me, he was like, "You gonna sell them?" I'm like, "Nah, bro, I'm wearing them." You know what I'm saying? Like, These are mine. Cause you know, resellers think with the reset mind, I'm not at that point yet, or whatever. Maybe soon, or whatever. No, but I'm not. I'm not in a reseller's place right now. Wow, so much detail in this shoe. Now, like I was saying before, um, I did some research later on, or a little while ago actually, um, to uh, verify if what he was telling me was true about these um, being the price that they were at uh, Flight Club. And he actually wasn't lying. I decided to go on Flight Club, and let me show you what I found. Let me pull it up real quick if I could find my photos. Where are my photos? There you go. And Fight Club size ten and a half is three hundred and twenty five dollars. So actually he got more out of the deal. Or whatever, because with these going for three hundred and twenty-five plus the hat, that was the three fifty right there, or whatever. But then he got a, yeah. Now that I'm thinking about it, yeah, I did take a L, cause he got a free pair of sneakers out the deal. Uh, focusing on that, on that three twenty-five mark right there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. So. Now that I'm thinking about it, I did take it out. But it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? I'm super happy about what I got right here. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no doubt about it, I'm, I, I'm not, no complaints from me. You know what I'm saying? But, so, pair 72 tens, Kilroy nines for a pair of what the LeBron 12s. <clears throat> okay, what the LeBron 12s. And let me show you what else I got. Because I did say he's doing a hat. And this was a hat that I wanted. But... <clears throat> I would have had to get it online. But luckily they had it. One second, I'll be right back. <coughs> Bam, I'm back. I hope Dan D kept you company while I was gone. Alright, this is the hat that um I wanted. And um I only saw it I only saw the company that was selling it. But you had to purchase it online. Luckily, they had it dead stock, along with some other hats. 
but I wasn't too fond of the other hats, so this was the one that I wanted out of all of the bunch or whatever. And first of all, it is a snapback. It is the S. And this is the hat right here. Sneaker Veterans. This hat is, I guess, uh, what the YouTubers are calling uh, Fuego. I'll put it on for you real quick. I don't got a haircut, so give me one second. <clears throat> Ugh, and I'm back. All right, so this is the hat right here, Fuego. And that was basically the trade. So once again, I traded the 7210's dead stock and Kilroy 9's use fair condition for LeBron, what the LeBron 12's and this hat. All right, so you tell me if I took a loss or if it was a even deal, let me know in the comments. And I wanna give a shout out to all my subscribers you know what I'm saying, you know, I know I'm not on you know, YouTube uh, all the time, every day with a different video. I'm trying to work on that or whatever, but I do think the subscribers that are following me at this point, you know what I'm saying, I will continue to do videos or whatever. I'm going to try to be more consistent with it, but I just want to give all you guys a shout out because I do see the comments um, when you guys write them and all the comments have been positive. So I want to thank you for that. And if you got any questions... Holla at me, let me know. Alright, this is your boy DRock779. I'm out.